Hello, my name is the Crafting Gamers and welcome back to another new video. So in this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how you can play Craftsman Building Craft with your long distance friends. So in this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to easily connect with your long distance friends in Craftsman Building Craft without needing to connect with them. So in my last video, I have published a video that saying how you can connect with your friends using Wi-Fi. So in that video, I have just shown you how to connect with your friends who are near you. But in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to connect with long distance friends whether they are from another country or another city in Craftsman Building Craft and you can play with them for fun time. So if you like this kind of videos, please consider subscribing and also like my video. Please comment in this video to see if it really works and I'll be pretty grateful for that. So without further ado, let's get started into today's video. So the first thing that you need to do is you just need to go back and then you just need to create a new world. That's it. So you just need to create your normal craftsman world like you just need to go to new and then you just you can name your world whatever you want you just have to create a new world that's all so i'm gonna be naming my world multiplayer world because in this world we are gonna be playing with our friends with our long distance friends in this video so i'm gonna be choosing the seed as a village seed so that's kind of cool and also we, i'm gonna be choosing survival mode so you just need to create world but before creating your world you just need to go to options and then switch these two on so you need to switch multiplayer game and broadcast to LAN on so if you only have those two on you can play multiplayer and you also need to change your name so as you can see I have changed my name to craft gamers but by default the name is actually Steve so you need to change that so and then you need to make sure that you have Wi-Fi on so if you have Wi-Fi and location on, you can play with your long distance friends and that's gonna be really important if you wanna play with them. So I'm gonna be going here and then I'm gonna be creating a new world. So you can name your world whatever you want. So I'm gonna be naming a world multiplayer world because we are gonna play multiplayer in this world only. So wait, yeah, now it's correct. So you can change whatever seed you want. So I'm gonna be choosing the villager seed because that's kind of cool. So I'm gonna be choosing survival mode which is the best and now here we are so here we are in the world and it's looking pretty nice and pretty cool so as you can see this world is in survival mode and now you can make a server from it so I'm gonna be quitting the world and then I'm gonna be making a new server so this server you just need to create this server for other friends to join so I'm gonna be naming it the same as the world we just created so you just need to put multiplayer world and then in this server IP address you just need to go put your own device IP address so for finding your device IP address you just need to go back and then you just need to go to the settings menu here we are in the settings menu and if you go if you just go to about phone you can get all the details of your phone's IP address and all that so I'm gonna be entering my own IP address in here so yeah so let's go I'm gonna be naming it the same and then for the IP address I'm gonna be naming 192.456.278 okay so IP address has been entered now the port you don't need to change the port all that much so the port can stay as 19132 and now you just need to click on add server so after you click on that as you can see we have got the server right here so we can join the server for ourselves so as you can see this is our new server so for long distance friends to connect to our world they need to enter the IP address of this world and also the port of the world to join our world so I'm gonna be showing you how your friends can join your world or your server that you have created and they can be from anywhere and they don't need to connect to your internet connection at all so I'm gonna be showing you just that so as you guys can see we are on our other phone now you just need to click on play and now you just need to click on the world that you have created and as you can see we have now joined the server and now your friends can join the server easily if they have entered all the details correctly so I'm gonna be showing you just that 
so guys this is another phone and i'm gonna be showing you now how anyone can join your world so i'm gonna be showing you how your friends can join your craftsman world from any place so they have to click on play and they must have to enable their mobile data and wi-fi so they have to click new and as you can see we have a server box so they just have to click it and they have a lot of options right here so they just need to uh, put any name so any world so yeah that's gonna work and now for the IP address they need to enter their own IP address so this IP address belongs to their mobile device so I'm gonna be putting this IP address so 192.168.43.1 so as you can see everything has been filled and the port you don't even have to change the port it can stay and now you just need to click on add server as usual and then this server will be added and you can join your friend from any place. So as you can see this has not been activated so I'm gonna be going on another device to see how you can activate the server. So as you guys can see the server has been activated so it says craft gamer so and also it has the IP address on all the port and stuff. So as you can see a total of 5 players can join and now the server is active and we can join from any place without needing to be near them. So if you just click on this so as you can see we have a message and yeah so this is our friend guys so here he is. This is how you can play with your friends in long distance like connections and stuff so this is gonna be pretty cool if you are living on another country you can play with any of your friends who is living on the other side of the world so that's gonna be pretty cool and you can play with up to five friends which is very very useful and also pretty cool and if you like this video please make sure to subscribe like and also comment if this method really worked and it's bye